All right, last talking point is the last scene. All four episodes that we saw have post credit scenes, and I promise you, somehow today's is not even close to the most absurd. They are ridiculous. Each time they will surprise you and get you to pop out with laughter. This one is no exception. It is, it is sharing details of old Stevie Raj, and that man was busy on that USO tour. I he. He, 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 it's a tour where a boy became a man. <laughs> I'm so happy about this. What do we even talk about this? Like we have to talk about this. But like what do we even say? Okay, okay. So I'm gonna try, like I'm gonna try to be as delicate and family friendly as possible. <laughs> uh, it has been a long-standing debate uh, about whether or not Cap has uh, become a man in his. <laughs> <laughs> his travels and you know we do have that moment in winter soldier where nat's like is that your first kiss since 1945 and um really good and, <laughs> <laughs> uh, and so we've all debated it but like i have always thought it was a stupid debate i mean uh he's a grown grown man uh touring the world you know, um, and I think that good for him. And, and, you know, it also makes me happy that he has confided in his friends. I love the idea that they're all sitting around telling the story of their first encounter. Um, and because because uh, Bruce knew the deets, um, I just just makes me happy. I am a little sad that it took Steve pumping up in serum for him to land a lady. Oh, he was um, pumping up. Ah, oh, I walked right into that one. But uh, anyway, I'm delighted. I'm not surprised. And I just love the way that it ended. Because one of my favorite buttons is, I've talked about this before, is in Homecoming. The way that Marissa Tomei, when when you end your thing on a uh, on a half bomb uh, of, a, of a funny, funny bad word, I'm going to laugh hard. <laughs> I will say, like, when I when I talked to Jessica at the premiere, she said, like, I was like, what are you most excited to see people respond to? And she was like, the, the tag at the end of this episode. She was like, if that is my one legacy that I leave on the world, then, like, that is worth it for me. And it's like, I can totally see why. Because I, every single time I watch this episode, I still cannot believe that they got away with it and that it is as brilliantly constructed of a scene as it is. I agree with Jamie. Like, cutting it off exactly where it is is hilarious. And Tatiana's delivery is just perfect. Chris in our comments said he went to war a boy and came back a man. <laughs> hey. Good for you, Steve. I'm in these shows for the memes in a lot of yep. ways. And people calling him Clapton America is funny <laughs> oh as all. My God. It's, it's oh my hysterical. God. It's hysterical. It's so funny. This that morning on Twitter has been so funny. <laughs> Brandon. I can. I mean, I could do this all day. <laughs> <laughs> and like wow. we do have to acknowledge, Chris mm -hmm. Evans has acknowledged the reference. He has tweeted a bunch of emojis and the hashtag She Hulk, so he knows. I I would pay so much money to have watched him watch that scene because, like, I I can only imagine his reaction. I would love to see it. <laughs> yeah, I imagine it was something like uh, his free guy cameo. Uh huh. <laughs> What the, what the she? Yeah, yeah. All right, well, what a good note to end today's show on.